Hello, this is Yolanda at Camp Wholesome Board, and today we are going to review this uh, drone, JJRC H71. The reason we bought the drone and would like to share with you is because we want to take um, better views or pictures of the places we visit so you can have a wider perspective of the area. First, let's talk about the very convenient carrying case. It's very secure, cushion. Um, the lid is foam and has two indentations to protect your joysticks. It also brings a manual and two quick references. Here is the controller and this is an attachment to your phone and you can expand it if your phone is bigger it brings two 11 minute batteries extra propellers and propeller guards in case you want to use them and a charging cable now let's talk about the controller so the controller you have on the right side, this circle here, you have arrows in different direction. This is for fine tuning in a specific direction, like forward, backward, left or right. In this, another area, you will have the quick start and descent, which is the one on the left that has the up and down arrows. This one on the bottom is to start video recording. And this one here turns on and off the lights on the drone. The one on the top, a long press, you will calibrate your drone and a short press will start the headless mode. Now the joysticks. This right joystick is exclusively to move forward, backwards, left and right for maneuvering. This one has two functions. The first one is to ascend and descend. And the other function is to sync the remote with the drone. To sync the remote with the drone, when you first turn them both on, the lights will be flashing. Let me show you here. So you see the lights flashing. When you turn on the controller, the lights also flashing. So to sync them, you press the joystick up and down. When you hear that noise, the one beep, and the lights are solid, then you know they're sync. And to confirm they're sync, you can try turning on and off the lights. And the last two buttons on the controller are on the sides. The left one, you can increase or decrease the speed of the drone uh, one beep when you press it short press it one beep indicates 30 percent two beeps 60 percent three beeps 100 percent and if you long press it you will exit the optical flow mode and what i know about optical flow is when it's on, it makes sure that the drone is aligned with the ground. This button here is to take pictures. This is a very nice purchase. Um, it's affordable. Um, it's sturdy because I crushed it already four times. It's a learning process. Um, it's very light. Like I said, it has a nice carrying case and um, it brings two batteries. So you can fly for 11 minutes, have the other one charging. So in total, you can fly 22 minutes and you can get great pictures and videos from that time. It's very user-friendly, at least for me. And um, I hope you enjoy it.
So if you are interested in checking out this drone, go to the description in the bottom of this video and press the link. It will take you to amazon.com. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel so you can join us in all of our adventures.